today we are going to learn chapter 2 uses of plants in this chapter we shall discuss the various uses of plants let us begin the chapter plants provide food clothing fuel shelter and many other necessities of life. Plants make the air clean and fresh. Plants help to make the soil more nutrient. Plants give shadows stay away from sun heat. So, plants can be taken as food, it helps in clothing, it provides us shelter, it keeps the air clean and fresh, it helps to make the soil more nutrient, it gives shadows to prevent the heat from the sun. Let us see how plants act as food. Different parts of the plant are used as food. Leaves, spinach and coriander. Stem, potato, sugar cane. Roots, Radish and carrots. Fruits, apple and mangoes. Seeds, rice and wheat. So, the different parts of the plant we know already are leaves, stems, roots, fruits, seeds. So, leaves of some plants like spinach, coriander uh, act as food. The stem of some plants like potato and sugar cane can be used as a food. The roots of some plants like radish, carrot can be used as a food. Fruits such as apple, mango, strawberry, any fruits you can mention can be taken as a food. Seeds, rice, wheat, etc. can be used as a food. Let us see how plants helps in making oil. We get cooking oil from groundnut, coconuts and also from mustard and sunflower seeds. We crush the seeds to get the oil. If the seeds of the mustard plant is crushed, we get mustard oil. If we crush the seeds of the sunflower, we get sunflower oil. If we crush the seeds of the coconut. We get coconut oil. Oil is used in making soap. Plants as drinks. We get tea, coffee and cocoa from plants. Cocoa beans, tea leaves and coffee beans are used for drinks. Beans are nothing but seeds. Cocoa beans that is seeds we get cocoa. Tea leaves helps to prepare as tea. Coffee bean when crushed we get coffee. 
we get coffee powder actually and we will get the drinks. We will get cocoa powder then we we'll can prepare cocoa chocolates. We can prepare choco drinking or cocoa beans are used in making chocolate and coca cola also. Plants as medicines. Let us see how plants are used in the field of medicines. Some plants are used as medicines. Tulsi can cure cough and cold. We can take turmeric for cooking and anti-inflammatory. You can ask your mother to show you a turmeric powder which she is using for cooking. Aloe vera. It is meant and healthy to for the skin. Amla. Amla is good for stomach. So the medicinal plants are Tulsi, Turmeric, Aloe vera and Amla. Tulsi prevents for and cold. Turmeric helps in cooking and has anti-inflammatory character. Aloe vera is used for skin treatment. Amla is meant for stomach. Plants as fibers. Cotton plant yield fibers for cloth. You can see a cotton plant. It is made into fiber and from the fiber we get cloth in the form of dress. Jute yield fibers to make sacks, ropes and mats. So you can see jute plant giving fibers that can be used to make ropes, mats, sacks, etc. Coconut also yield fibers to make sacks, ropes and mat. Plants as wood. Woods from the plants are used to make doors, windows, chairs, tables, etc. Woods made from Teak and rosewood. Wood for our pencils comes from plants. Villagers use wood as fuel. Let us see the other uses of plants. Paper is made from bamboo and pine trees. Gum is made from the juice of acacia stem. Rubber is made from the white sap of rubber tree. Plants for decoration, scents and perfumes. Flowers of plants look beautiful. They have sweet smell. We decorate our homes with flowers and leaves. In the vase, is it not? Scents and perfumes are made from rose and jasmine flowers. Let us have a chapter recap. Plants gives us food, oil, drinks and medicines. Plant fibers are used to make cloths, sacks, ropes and mats. We get wood 
from plants to make furniture such as chair, table, etc. Paper, gum, rubber and scents are made from plants. Plants are used for decoration, protection, fodder and manure. Plants make the air fresh and clean. This completes our chapter 2. Thank <laughs> you.